What is up folks and welcome to another episode of Rob's Corner. So glad to have you here and as promised I've got with me a Darkness Ablaze booster box. A total of 36 packs meaning this is going to be a two part series. For those that are new to the world of Pokemon or TCG also known as trading card game. There are many types of cards from common to ultra rare. I'm a collector through and through but when you get a shiny new rare card I can't help but get ecstatic. And with every new series comes a wave of new rare and ultra rare cards. And some of those ones that we're looking for are some of my personal favorites, such as Tarzard, which is going to be a VMAX variant, a Houndoom V, a uh, Rhyferior V, and some of the ultra rare cards like uh, Crobat V, Eternus V Max, Decidueye, uh, and many, many more, guys. If you want to know more about what kind of cards there are, like what's a rare, what's an uncommon, go ahead and go to the comment section and leave me a question, and I promise I'll answer it in the next video. All right, folks, let's get to it, shall we? All right, guys, so I went ahead and pulled off the plastic cover. And like I said, there's 36 packs in here, so we're going to do just 18. And let's take a look at these cover arts real quick. So we have Scent of Scorch, which is a pretty nice cover. We have a Grim Snarl. Eternus. And, and here we go. And we have a Charizard right here, which is a really nice cover art as well. So I'm just gonna go ahead and start opening them up. What are you guys looking forward to? Do you guys actually know about Darkness Ablaze, which packs are, I mean, which cards you guys are actually looking for, for those that are collectors as well? Oh my God, I'm having trouble opening up this pack. All right, guys, so let's do the same as always. Get rid of that code. There. One, two, three. And the first one is a Heat Energy. Now that is really nice because that is a, a card that most people are looking for. It's a special energy. Really great pull off the front. Uh, a Relicanth. A Zvelis. Torchic. I think that looks like a Claymation. That's really cute. A Trapinch. A Jigglypuff. A Ducklet. A Carablast. A Dracovish, which is a reverse hollow, and that is a rare as well. Really nice looking there, and I don't think I've actually seen this one yet. I just started Sword and Shield on the Switch, so I'm not quite familiar with Sword and Shield all that well. And then we have another rare, a Bertic. It's just a standard one. And then we have a Energy. So let's put those to the side. So I don't think it's three on these, I think it's four on these packs. So I'm going to do that instead. Open up another one. So again, I was really excited if I pulled that Charizard. I'm trying to find it. So let's put that there. One, two, three, four. And we got a regular energy. A Poltergeist. I think that's how you say it. Poltergeist. A Soul Rock. A Kabu. A Gothka. Goth Gothita. A Skomori. A Kubchu. Kubchu. Kubcho. A Wimpod. I, I don't think that's the standard color. A Bumblebee, which is actually a pretty nice card for attacking in one of your decks, which is pretty nice. And then we got a Steaming, Reverse Hollow, which is just a um, uncommon. And a Sizar V. Wow, guys, that is crazy off the second pack. That is amazing. Oh crap. I'm so I'm gonna try to zoom in so you guys can see better. That is really clean. I love that. Can't believe we got that right off the second pack. Man, that's going right into a sleeve. That is awesome, guys. <laughs> oh man. I'm loving this already. You know, this is my first time ever buying a booster box. So the next one we're gonna do is the Grim Snarl. I believe he's a newer type of Pokemon from Sword and Shield. I can't believe that's the second pack you got that. Alright guys, put this code card over there. And it is a green code card, so one, two, three, four. We got a water energy. A familiar bell. Struggle gloves. Uh, this is a tool for one of your Pokemon that doesn't already have a Pokemon tool attached. So this is Clang. A Galarian uh, Duramaka. Which usually it's red and a fire type, and now it is a water ice type, I'm guessing. A Larvitar. A Nicket. 
So, I don't know about you guys who play the game, but I actually really like Nicket. Uh, I know a lot of people don't like his final form. They say he's kind of on the weak side, but I honestly like him a lot. And I believe this is a Thief-type Pokemon. A Bunsweet. Bounsweet. A Snubble. A Lunatune, Lunatone. Uh, Reverse Hollow. And this is just a Uncommon. So Uncommon guys will have a diamond on the bottom right there. Uh, common is a circle. And then the star would be a rare. Like this one right here is a standard rare. Non-hollow. And this is Swanna. And then the next pack we're going to pull from the Scent Scorch. Hopefully we get something nice. It'd be crazy if all we pulled was just one V out of all of this, or a VMAX, nothing else, just that one V. So, let's get our code card, which is a white code card. One, two, three, four. So we got just a standard energy, a Corvus Cure. I, I probably butchered that name. We got a Rose, which is a card that many people actually are looking for. He's not a, a, a rare, but he is uncommon, but this is a very good card. Uh, a Vanillish. A uh, Grimer. Clink. And we have Ducklet. Mary, still one of my favorites of all time. A Paris. A Reverse Hollow Grimer. Oh my god, guys. Another one. Oh my god. I got the Grim Snarl VMAX. Oh my god, guys. Oh man, that that is amazing. I, I did not expect to pull that so early, if not at all. That is amazing. Holy, oh, wow. Look at that beautiful card, guys. That is, that is an epic card to pull right now. Look at that, 330 HP. Um, he does a G-Max Drill, which does 170 plus. This attack does 50 more damage for each uh, Dark Energy. Attach this Pokemon in addition to this attack cost. You can't add more than 100 damage in this way, but my god, guys, that's an amazing pull. I'm ecstatic. Holy crap, guys. Wow. Darkest of Blaze does not fail. That is amazing. Oh, man. <laughs> that was off the uh, Center Scorch pool. Wow. So the next pack is uh, Charizard. And it's going to be a green code card, so, it's, so I wonder what we're going to get. Two, three, four. Next is a Psychic Energy Basic, uh, Dark Chicks, Didini, Bird Keeper, Meltan. Yes, I know, this is probably killing a lot of you that I just have a pile like this. I'll clean it up in a second. A Meltan, another Bunnelby. You know, I really love that artwork. It, it's pretty different from what they normally do. I really like that. Another Paris. Lobitar. Golit. Another, oh no, this is a reverse hollow wind pod. It's pretty nice. And a Kling Kling, which is our rare non hollow. That is pretty cool as well. But so far, those two pulls have been beyond what I thought I was going to get. Alright, guys, let me just clean that up real quick. I know it's probably killing a lot of you. <laughs> Normally, I don't like to do that myself. But I just got kind of excited over what I pulled and I haven't been cleaning them up as we go. Alright, guys. Done. Wow, I'm, I'm, I don't know if you guys know, but th those are amazing pools right off the bat. Super excited. And we still have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 more packs to go. Put those right there. Next one is going to be Eternus. Wow. Super ecstatic. I don't even... Oh my god, that is awesome. We still have eight more packs to go on the next video. Alright guys, another green card. One, two, three, four. So we got a basic energy, Thunder. A Steeny. Again, that's a common, I mean uncommon, and Dendini is an uncommon. Then we have Vibra Vibrava. A Sinisty. Feebas. A Casimir, I cannot say that. Uh, Casimian. I'm gonna just go with that, guys. Fletching. A Wimpod. A Reverse Hollow Fletching. And a Greedent. 
I was kind of hoping for more guys <laughs> after those last two pulls. Alright, on to the next pack. And we're gonna go with the Grim Snarl. Oh my god, I'm just, I'm so... Alright, moving on. Let's just keep going, guys. I know I'm gonna pull something else pretty nice. If I pull a Charizard or a Houndoom, I will... I will be just beyond... I'll, I'll... Nah, I don't even know. I'll just... I'll be happy, alright, guys? I will be happy. Alright, one, two, three, four. Alright, you got your, uh, Fighting Energy. Aradas. Doug Trio. Billowing Smoke. Squavet. Shelmet. Pan 4, that is a pretty cool picture. Teddy Ursa. Rookity. Bird Keeper, which is a reverse hollow, uncommon. And a Digzerby. That is our rare, also a non hollow. Alright, so the last pack, that's when we got him, the Grim Snarl. So hopefully you pull something nice on this one too. Let's see. Man, these are really hard to open. That or I just don't have one of the pianos. Alright guys, pull it aside. And we got a white card, so hopefully it's something good. Two, three, four. Alright guys, Fire Energy, just a basic one. Uh, Aridos again. You know, that's a really impressive HP right there. A Familiar Bell. Rose Tower, which is a, a card I believe most people are looking for. It is a uncommon, but it's a good card to have for Stadium. And then we have a Toxel, a Skitty, Rowlet, Wishy Washy from, I believe that was from Sun and Moon. I wasn't a huge fan of it, I was expecting more. A Q Fent, Manetric, Reverse Hollow Rare, that is pretty cool guys. But for, hopefully because we got a white card, let's pull something good, and oh my god, we just got Eternus V. Guys, I am just wow blown away with the amount of cards that I pull I mean I, I've had you know uh, a couple you know 15 cards before or packs before and we've never really pulled more than maybe three or four decent ones but oh my god guys this is crazy to pull it turns V one of the the cards that everyone's looking for we got the Grimms are uh, Grim snarl V max and a pretty cool pull for the Sizor V now that is amazing guys I am just wow that artwork looks amazing. The way the colors look, that is so cool, guys. I'm gonna zoom in this a little bit more. That is so freaking cool. So he has 220 HP, he has Power Accelerator at 30 damage. You may attach a uh, Dark Energy card, or is that Steel? No, I think it's Dark. Guys, I am so out of it right now. If your opponent's activate Pokemon is a VMAX, this attack does 120 more damage. So that's pretty crazy to have 240 plus damage. Wow. Such great pools, guys. I don't know if you know this, those that are new to the world of Pokemon, but those are such amazing cards. Um, also, one of the rules is you can only have one VMAX card or, um, you know, a v, I believe a V type Pokemon at a time. So, but regardless, those are such great pools, guys. So, our next pack is a Charizard pack, and it is a white code card. So, maybe we'll get lucky and pull another rare card. That, that's crazy, guys. So we have Psychic Energy, uh, Simisar, Sim Simisir, Alarion, Old PC, that's crazy. Uh, flip two coins at both their heads, put a card from the discount pile into your hand. We got a Rookity again, a Wishy Washy, a Pansage, a Tauros, a Diglett, I like the little uh, statue in the back, or I'm not even sure if that is a statue or a shrine. Uh, a Cufant, a Reverse Hollow, 100 HP with 60 damage, that's a pretty impressive card. And a Susuin, uh, Susuin. wow, a Hollow, just a normal Hollow, dude, that, that, that's cool. Uh, I've been crazy because I haven't seen a, a regular Hollow in a while. He is our rare, then for a white card, I'm pretty, or a code, code card, guys, I'm, I'm tripping over my tongue because of how excited I am for these pools. So he has 120 HP, Aurora Loop. Um, just amazing pull so far, guys. I've never had this much luck before. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm happy, guys. I don't even know if you know this, but like, I'm just shocked on the, the, the rate of these pulls. 
All right, so the next one is Cinderscorch. He hasn't let us down yet. Let's keep going with another great pool. Still looking for that Charizard. So this is a green code card. One, two, three, four. Fire Energy. Cothrita. Pokemon Breeders Nurturing. Combuskin. Another Skitty. Hand Sage. Another Golet. Vanillite. A Tramp Inch. And again, I love the artwork. A Darkrai. Wow. Reverse Hollow. Guys, that is a pretty cool pull as well. Darkrai is one of the better Pokemon I have in the lineup when you're fighting against other players. Um, in the actual Pokemon games, I've never actually had a chance to use them in a TCG battle. But that is so nice. Sweet. Um, so he has Darkness Guard. This Pokemon has any dark energy attached to it. It takes 20 less damage from attacks, even uh, after applying weakness and resistance. So Vortex, Vortex Darkness, this attack does 20 more damage for each dark energy attached to this Pokemon. He's, he's a pretty beast Pokemon. And a, wow, a Malmetal. That is pretty cool. He's a non-hollow, but it's really nice as well. Um, he has 150 damage, heavy impact is 130, and energy link. Still a great pool, guys. Wow, I'm, I'm, so, I'm loving Darkness of Blaze. Sword and Shield, the standard packs were cool, but I think Darkness of Blaze just blows it out of the water with the, the way the cards look, the, the way the Pokemon are, and the attack status. Everything is great about him. All right, guys, another green card. So one, two, three, four. Have you guys seen anything you've liked so far? What was your favorite pull out of this pack thus far? And I'll ask that again at the end of the video. So Psychic, a Spike Muth, Muth? Spike, Spike Muth, right? I think so. Cape of Toughness, nice pull. Uh, Vibrava, another Wimpod. Man, he is pretty common in these packs. A Grimer, a Clink, Ducklet, Mary, a Rare Fossil, a Reverse Hollow, a common card, but that is pretty cool. You could play this card as if it were a 70 HP basic uh, normal Pokemon card at any time during your turn and then discard from play. And we have a Glaren Mr. Mime. That is a rare non hollow So what is your thoughts on Mr. Oh, Mr. Ryan, not Mr. Mime versus Mr. Mime though? I thought, I didn't even know Mr. Mime had an evolved form. That was pretty cool. I'm just reading this guy's I've never seen Mr. Ryan before, but I'm glad he has an uh, evolution because he's been around since the very beginning of the Pokemon series, back in 1997, I believe, 1996, at least in America. All right, guys, the next pack is Eternal's pack, and it is a white code card, so hopefully you pull something great. Four. We got our Still Energy, Billowing Smoke, Turbo Patch. Now that is a uncommon, but is a card most people are looking for right now as well. So I'm pretty happy with that pull. And then we got the Brava, a Dunsparce, Electrike, a Glare and Mr. Mime. Now I have both of them, so I can involve them when I'm playing. A Grimer, another Clink, a Reverse Hollow Swana. Ooh, I think I just seen the next card, guys. So that is pretty nice as well. Feather Slice. Um, Sky uh, Circus, if you play the Bird Keeper from your hand during the turn, ignore all energy in this Pokemon's attacks cost. And that is a nice ability. A really nice ability, actually. For 110 HP. And then we have yeah, a Hollow baby. Blaziken. Wow, 170 HP. Uh, Turbo Drive, attach a basic energy card from your discard pile to one of your bench Pokemon, 130. All right, guys, so real quick, a Reverse Hollow is when everything's hollow in the background. A normal hollow is when just the Pokemon is hollow, um, which is really cool because if you look closely, I don't know if you guys can see, the white feathers around him are actually non-hollow, but the rest of his body is. So that's a pretty nice design on how they did that. Um, back in the day, they didn't have these lines going through it, but I really like how the hollows look now compared to then. Really great pull, guys. All right, next pack is Grim Snarl. Let's see what he gives us. At the end of the video, guys, towards the end of the, the video, I'm going to show you all again the rare cards that we pulled so far, uh, the hollows. So let's go green card. One, two, three, four. So water energy. Oops, sorry, guys. Glimwood Tangle. Uh, Larion. Parasect. A Q-Fent. 
a Sinistee, another Feebas. Ah, I'm just gonna skip his name, guys. I'm, I'm not gonna butcher it again. A Fletchling, Teddy Ursa, Reverse Hollow, and a Selgor. Jet Headbutt, 70 damage. So this is a rare. I kind of like that artwork and the moon in the background. It's really cool. Um, and it looks like they, the clouds are in the background. Yeah, this is a pretty cool artwork. I like it a lot. All right, guys, we have one, two, three, four, and five left. Next is a Senti Scorch. Still no luck on the Charizard or Houndoom or a Crobat. Still looking for those. Let's see what we pull next. Ooh, green code. Might get lucky on a nice pull. So let's put that to the side. One, two, three, four. All right, guys. So, Dark Energy, a Toxapex, which is an uncommon, a Kling, Simisage, he looks pretty tough, guys, a Jigglypuff, a Diglett, Panpour, a Spinarak, Bonsweet, a Purloin, a Swana, and that is our rare non hollow. All right. Come on, Charizard, give me something good. I'm gonna be greedy and just keep wanting more and more now that I've pulled some amazing cards, and what do you know, guys? A white code card. Maybe we are gonna get lucky. One, two, three, four. Wow, that bird's super loud in the background. So, uh, Leaf Energy, Erasing, Poltergeist. I feel like he's doing it on purpose now. Combuskin, more lol. Toxel. Actually, I've not seen that Pokemon before, but I think it's a really cute Pokemon card. I actually like him, and I think I'm going to try to catch him once I go back in the Switch, uh, the, the Sword and Shield game. Oh no! I just knocked all them over. Skitty. Rowlet. Wishy Washy. We have a Reverse Hollow Rare. Clink Clang. Pretty cool pool. And we have an Arctazolt. That is cool because he is one of the cards that everyone is looking for. Fighting Whirlpool, whenever your opponent attaches an energy card from their oh my god, that bird is driving me crazy. And one of your hand of their Pokemon, put two damage counters on that Pokemon Electro Ball. So that is an amazing pool, guys. And it evolves from the rare fossil, which we haven't pulled yet, I think. I think we just got an old fossil. But that is such an amazing pool. I am so happy with Darkness of Blaze so far. Wow, I can't believe I knocked this all over, guys. I really should put these in sleeves as soon as I can. I forgot to grab them before I started the video. <sighs> Be real careful with them. All right. Wow, that bird's driving me crazy. Three packs left. And I apologize about that, guys. All right, next pack is a Eternus. And it is a white coat card, so hopefully you pull something nice. One, two, three, four. Thunder Energy. Got the Rita. Piers. So he's uncommon, but a lot of people are looking for this trainer supporter card. Um, search your deck for an energy card and a dark uh, Pokemon. Reveal them and put them into your hand and then shuffle the deck. A powerful energy. Another nice pull. A lot of people are also looking for that card as well. As long as this card is attached to a Pokemon, it provides star energy. So that is a really great card. Another Purloin. A Starly, who also has Sky Circus. That is a really great ability, in my opinion. An Aeron. Kubcho. Kubchu. I don't even know. A Rowlet. A Shenotic. This is a Uncommon, but it is Reverse Hollow. Really nice. Oh my god, guys. A Butterfree V. That is so cool. He was one of my first Pokemon in the in the game who was on my team to help me beat the Elite Four. That is a really cool card. Kind of plain in, in the background, but still very nice on the design of the wings. Really great looking. I like that a lot. Um, so he has Dizzying Poison. Your opponent's active Pokemon is now Confused and Poison, which is a great effect. And Blasting Wind, which does 130 uh, damage. He has 190 HP. So cool. Look at his eyeballs. Wow, man, this has just been an amazing uh, card opening session, guys. Oh, man. Two more packs, no Charizard. Had some amazing pulls so far, and we still have 18 more in the next video, guys. But so far, I am so happy with this box. Alright, green card, still have a chance to pull something amazing. Two, three, four. 
Let's see. Fighting Energy. Soul Rock. Uh, Reliacanth. A uh, Yalhorn. Feebas. A Purloin. Hippo. Hippop. Hippopodas? <laughs> Hippop Anonymous. Alright, guys. Sentry. Larvesta. Alarian Reverse Hollow. And a Menentric. Still a nice card. He does Strength, Flash Impact, 110 HP. Alright, guys. Last pack. Sent to Scorch. Has not let us down yet. Has been amazing. Let's see what we get on this last one. So again, guys, if you have any questions about, you know, how to play the Pokemon game, um, what's a good pack to start with, or, you know, how to build a deck, or if you guys just want to know more about how it works, like the common, uncommon, rare, ultra rare, um, hidden rares as well. I forgot to mention that. There are such things as hidden rares. we got another white code card. One, two, three, four. Go ahead and, you know, just put it in the comment section. Either I'll message you in, in the comment section, or I'll get back to you in the other video, um, depending on how many questions we get. So next card is Fire Energy, Simisage, I don't know why I had that in my other hand, uh, Vanillish, Clang, Toxel, Sinistee, Horroblast, which has been popping up all over in Pokemon Go, Meltan, um, Marini, which is a common card, a Reverse Hollow Shelmet, and a King's Kong Hollow rare. That is cool. Uh, he does hammer in 100 damage, rally back, 30 plus. If any of your Pokemon were knocked out by damage from an attack from your opponent during their last turn, this attack does 90 more damage. 120 plus, or 120 damage, guys, which is a really good card. And on the bottom, it says you shouldn't get too close to, this, to the child when it's playing outside its mother's pouch. Its mother is always nearby watching over it. Very protective mother. Alright guys, so again, I'll show you the red pools that I pulled out of the hollows. We got the Butterfree. Such an amazing card. We got the Blaziken Hollow. I'm going to show this one just because he's pretty rare in Pokemon Go. The only way to get him is through Pokemon uh, Let's Go Pikachu or Eevee. You have to trade in some Pokemon to get him. Our very first pull out of this pack was the Sizor V. Which does a 210 damage. He does hack off for 30. Dispo uh, discard a Pokemon tool and a special energy from your opponent's active Pokemon, which is pretty nice sometimes. Then it has Slashing Claw. Uh, we have the Dark Rye, which does 120 damage. He is Reverse Hollow. The Susu uh, Suqueen, Susuin, which is 120. We have the Eternus V, which is still probably one of my favorites out of this pack. Next to the Grim Snarl V Max at 330. We have the Act Result, such an amazing pool. It's like a dragon wearing like a, I want to say like a shark, thin legs with a, I don't know, a, a tub around him. It looks kind of funny, but I like that card. Then we have the Reverse Hollow Cling Cling. And then we have the Kangas Kong with 130 HP, guys. So, what was out of all these packs, your favorite card out of these first 18? Let me know in the comment section, guys, because so far I'm loving everything about Darkness of Blaze. I can't wait to build a good deck with these. Um, uh, I do play, like I said. If you guys ever want to play with me, just let me know, and we'll figure something out. All right, guys, that's going to be it for this video. Um, come, come in two weeks, we'll have part two. And hopefully, we'll finally get that Houndoom, Crobat, or Charizard. Thanks for sticking around, guys. Thanks for the support. I'll see you next time.